that they got it home. Diaz is dialed in for eight seconds. Got pulled down right around the whistle. But the clock says eight. It is under official review, and you already see him. Sore, but excited for that one. And he should be excited because this is a phenomenal ride. I do not like the way he is reaching down and holding that left groin. A replay official going to be looking to see if he was there for the eight seconds. Again, watching that left hand, I believe, to see if it makes contact with the bull before the eight seconds. It's going to be very close, but I think... Okay, give me the one from the back on the shoots. Again, I think the bigger story is long-term effect for Kansas City. And does Casio Diaz, the event MVP, leave here healthy? Right no there. matter the outcome. It's, it's a good, guys. Marking. It's good. Back-to-back so, back, PBR Brazil champion takes that success from his home country right here to Bridgestone Arena for the Kansas City Outlaws. And what about this? His fourth qualified ride and his third 90 of the weekend. This one. 91 and a quarter aboard Mike's motive. And that's huge because that puts pressure on Texas and Brady Fielder because if he rides his bull, he's got to be better than 91 and a quarter to steal this event title away from Kansas City. Cassio Diaz just stepped up huge for the Outlaws. Not only that, can we mention that he has been 94 times. I know one was 89 and <laughs> three quarters, but We're I say that's it. 90. That is incredible right there. Four 90-point rides. You want to talk about a little bit of a sore body? Absolutely when you have to ride four for 90. <laughs> that's a really good point.